Let's make a jar file. Oh! Alright, we find ourselves in Intelligent once more, and in this tutorial, we're gonna be creating the jar file. So this is actually very straightforward. It works the same for both Forge and Fabric, and it is very easy. What you can do is you just go to the Gradle tab at the top right corner, and you're gonna go to Build, and then you're gonna double click Build right here. The window down here will open, and it's gonna start building your jar file. Once again, just take a little bit of patience here, and then in a few seconds, we should hopefully be ready. Now, after your build successful, you can be assured that your jar file is ready for you. However, there is one very important thing that you need to keep in mind. And that is, if you now were to press the start key over here, it will run the build task. Make sure to go onto here, select it and select run client again, so then you can run the client again. And if you ever want to build again, you can switch to build and then just press the run key and then continue along and building your jar. Now, where is your jar located? Well, it is located in the build folder. So what you're gonna do is you're just gonna right click the build folder, open in Explorer, and here it is right here, the build folder. So we're just gonna click on this, go to the libs one. In both cases for Fabric and Forge, they're both under the build libs folder, and it should usually be the shorter name that is your correct jar. Not the dev, not the sources, and also not the sources dev. This one right here. You can now add this to your mods folder. Don't, of course, forget the dependencies that you might have added. So if you added GeckoLib, you, of course, need to add GeckoLib as well. If you're using Fabric, you, of course, need to add Fabric as well. Forge, the same thing. All of those, keep that in mind as well. But that is pretty much all that you need to do to build your jar file. And that concludes the 118 series. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the 119 tutorial series. So, yeah.